So for more on just how full Oroville and the other reservoirs actually are, let's go ahead and check in with Dirk Verdorn. Yeah, it's pretty impressive. Some of the largest reservoirs, how much water we have in them right now, and there's a lot more water to come. So starting off to the north, get our, our big reservoir here, Shasta, 96% full. That's not a mistake, 96% of capacity right now. So that's a lot of water that's in there and that's why they're going to have to be getting rid of a lot of water because there's more to come. Last year at this time was at 50% capacity. So that water is going to be making its way down the Sacramento River. Lake Oroville, look at that. Today it's at 91% capacity compared to a year ago where it was sitting at 53% capacity. So again, a lot of water in the reservoir and that too is why they're letting so much water into the Feather River. Now the Folsom Lake Reservoir here, as you can see, it's not as not as much as the others. Again, but this can fill up and also drain fairly rapidly. So it's sitting at 78% of capacity, and they're letting a lot of that water out through Lake Natoma and down the American River. But last year at this time, it was 76% of capacity. And through New Malones, timing it out perfectly. We're at 62%, so that means it's got a lot of room left to hold some of that water that's going to be coming down. So that's going to help out with flood control. Last year at this time, it was sitting at 39% of capacity. So that's the going on with our local reservoirs. 